Yes, this is true, I believe. This is why I wanted to have this series or talk about this um, coercive control and psychological abuse because so much of marriage is like, this stuff is ingrained in the theory of marriage. If you go back and watch the first video that I did on tactic one, which was one-sided power games, like we talked about how Bill like came out and said it, hey, I think that I should be able to set the rules. You do what I say and I do what I feel like doing. However, in that same article, in that section that I showed on that video, um, there was two or three other guys and what they were saying equaled up to what Bill was saying, but it was given to us like we've heard it so many times before, like in church or we've just been socialized to think that way. But they were all saying the same thing. The main point being that a lot of the things that we were taught to want or taught to go after or even the order of things that we were taught to follow keeps us in a place where we're more susceptible to being abused through coercion and um, psychological abuse tactics. I think the further and further that we go through the series, you'll begin to see that that power and control will is synonymous for marriage.